Hey guys, <clears throat> it's a busy day in the sticker factory. I've got a lot going on today. Uh, I was running into some issues that are driving me crazy. And because I'm here to teach y'all and help y'all with what I learned, I wanted to go ahead and let y'all know what I'm dealing with this morning on this busy day. All right, I was supposed to go meet up with my mom, uh, with my son here in a little bit and go have some lunch. So I'm in a rush to try to get a bunch of orders done. I was hoping to have all these done today. Um, I was running into some issues. These are business card style stickers that I make here. Let me show you what I got going on. So, all right, this will work to show you. So you see how I printed these with a little bit of a margin to try to make sure that I was within the line. All these ones that I popped out are fine, but then look at this. They shifted big time on a lot of these. Um, let me show you here, for example, look at this. So, that's not going to work, obviously. That's huge shift. And it did that on a huge amount of it. So every now and then, I mean, it's going to shift slightly. But these Graph Tech cutters are extremely accurate, honestly. And so for it to shift this much, something's got to be really off. Unfortunately, I started cutting. I cut two full sheets before I, or three sheets before I realized that it's not... I mean, I thought that it was something in the design that I miss that I messed up on, but it's not. It's something way worse. Um, I mean, there was something else going on. So let me show you what I, I I figured out what it was. I mean, I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, you know, I'm I'm showing y'all how to do stuff. I should have this figured out. I shouldn't have these problems. I mean, all these ones right here on this side are fine. But then when it came over to these, as you can see. I mean, it started shifting pretty bad. Um, I mean, that's cut towards the bottom. That was not horrible, but as you can see all the way over here, it cuts way into it. So what I realized is it's the crop marks. This image is too close over here. The solution, you get some little you get some vinyl or something um this is what i'm using here i have my circle labels i you can cut them like into fours or whatever and then you put something right here put it right here to cover the corner of it that way the the center has some room basically you almost want this to be a whole square where there's no color in it so that the sensor knows exactly where that crop mark is. Cause I think what was happening is it was reading the edge. It was eating, reading the edge of the actual sticker as the crop mark instead. And that was creating this huge shift on one side. So, cause that's what happened over here on this sheet that I was doing. And as you can see, I added these into it and it stopped doing it. Cause watch when I first started cutting it, this was the this was where it started cutting over here. I can immediately see it was off. You can see how far these uh, these were off. Look at this one right here. It was cutting all the way over into the other image. And um, I and then I stopped when it got into the first two. I saw it was way off, so I stopped. I put these white pieces of uh, you know sticker decal what you know whatever i'm trying to say the circle labels i put them in the corners there and redid everything you know uh re-ran it through the machine and it cut everything perfectly that time cut it perfectly they're all right where they should be now so i wasted quite a bit of material but now i got it figured out so it's all good so just so you know if you're ever having that problems that's what you got to do so yep yeah, busy day I'm going to get back to work. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, subscribe. I appreciate all the support. I appreciate all of y'all that have reached out to comment. Um, everyone that I've helped. I've helped people, some people privately lately, offline. And um, it's good knowing that y'all are reaching out. It's nice to see that we're building a little community here. So continue to like, follow, share, subscribe. And um, I'm going to keep this going. Thanks, guys.